Hello everyone, I'm Isha and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm thrilled to be part of Order News June Stamp Dye Stencil Release Blog Hop. For today's video, I'm sharing how to emboss using multicolor embossing powders and then use a few pigment powders to create beautiful colorful background. I'm using the Pen Sketch Mandala Stamp from the new release along with the Superscript Stamp and Dies. I'm also using Alternews Rose Gold, Copper and Platinum Embossing Powders. For my card, I have a purple card base, a white matte layer and a Canson watercolor layer for the background technique. I adhered the stamp to the Fisker stamp press. This gives me a bit of wiggle room. I am using the powder tool to remove static from the paper to get a clean embossed panel. I am applying Versamark to the image and stamp it onto the watercolor paper. First I will be using gold embossing powder. Use it to the part of the image. Now add platinum and then copper embossing powders. Heat emboss the powders. I am always fascinated by the powder melting resulting in a beautiful shine. I will stamp and emboss two more times in the similar way to fill the panel. For the next step, I have some Cosmo Cricut Pixie Paints in Pool, Ruby and Harbor colors along with Ken Oliver's Color Burst Turquoise Powder. I have the full supplies and colors in the description box below. I am sprinkling a bit of powder. Be careful as a little goes a long way here. Spray some water and see the magic happen. Now I am adding some blue and green powders and again spraying a bit of water. Using a paintbrush, I'm helping the water and the color move a bit. Now I'm dabbing excess color using a kitchen towel and add red powder to this panel. Spray a bit of water again. Heat set this panel. Once it's dry, the colors will lighten. So repeat the steps as per your liking. I repeated all the steps once again. Meanwhile, onto a purple panel, we will stamp and emboss the word hello. Prepare the purple cardstock using powder tool. Apply Versamark ink and stamp. Add white embossing powder to the stamped image. I'm, I have some uh, stray embossing powder so I am removing it using a fine brush. Now we will heat set this panel. We will die cut the word using the coordinating die. Now 
I am cutting this panel using the paper cutter. I will adhere it to the white layer using score tape. Score tape is strong and it helps the watercolor panel stick straight. Now we will adhere this panel to the purple card base. Off camera I had die cut a vellum circle. I will use the words my friend from the leaf cluster stamp set also from the new release. Stamp it to a scrap white piece using Versafine black ink and cut into a stripe. Adhere hello to the vellum using Tombow mono glue. I am using 3D foam behind the white strip. Using liquid glue to the back side of the vellum circle, adhere it to the panel. Now adhere the strip and our card is done. Hope you like the process. Subscribe to my channel to not miss any future videos. Have a nice day. Bye.